Hello guys and welcome back to another video. If you are new here on my channel, hello, my name is Andrada. I do cool videos like this and beauty videos here on my channel. So stick around for more videos like this. Today's video, as you can see by the title, is going to be another haul. And you guys know I love a haul. Um, I watch these all the time. I love making these. And today one is actually going to be a coast one. Um, now, I used to shop with them some time ago. I really, really like the trousers that they do. One, because they're high-waisted and flare and they're really, really good quality. So even though you are paying a little bit more for your items, it is really good quality. I had mine for years and years. Um, but this haul is actually just going to be on the Amy Neville um, collaboration that they've done together and I have chosen quite a few pieces. I'm really excited to actually see what they look like. She looks absolutely gorgeous in all the pictures for the campaign um, and I chose I want to say about eight items or so. I'll tell you how many, I'll tell you the pros and cons. I'll link them for you in the description so you find them really, really easily. Um, and of course I'll try them on so you can see what they look like on. But let's get started because I'm actually really excited to finally see what they look like. So I'll start with the first item, which is actually a blazer. I would say it's not actually white, it's an off-white blazer. It was in a size H, and it might look a little bit more white uh, to you guys just because I am in front of a window. Um, but this is what it looks like. So you have your buttons here. You've got two um, pockets, I believe. Yes, yeah, you have two pockets. Um, size A is just great. I wouldn't say it's too oversized. It's a little bit oversized. I would actually wear this unbuttoned. So I'll show you what it looks like if I manage to unbutton it. I need both hands for this. So I do not have the skill required. There we go. So that's what it looks like inside. It is double line, which I love. But yeah, just a really good structured blazer in white. I feel like you could wear this with so many things. Um, I do have quite a few black blazers. However, I want to add to my white blazers. It was 44.50, which actually is not bad. If you think that you can get a blazer like this from Zara, you are paying about 50 pounds. It does say that it was reduced from 89 pounds now. I'm not sure about that and you can get the trousers that match the blazer I'm not sure if I did I might no I don't think I've got the trousers because I didn't have it in my size but I feel like if you can get your hands on the trousers which are 34.50 you have a really really good outfit and matching uh, blazer and trousers you can't go wrong with that so I've just chucked on the blazer on top of this outfit and just paired it with some white sandals as well just so you can see I would definitely wear it like this also or I would wear it just as normal as a blazer with maybe just a t-shirt a plain t-shirt to just make it a little bit more casual where at the moment it's looking a tiny bit more formal I feel like it's in that between um, formal and just like really really casual but no, I do really like it. Next up, I have a crop top and I actually really love the color of this. And when I put it on as well, it actually looks really good. I was in two minds because sometimes crop tops do not suit me very much or are not really my style. But this one is a little bit more dressy. I absolutely love the color of this. It's so pretty, so in style, very summery. I got this in a size small and let's see how much it was 24.50 so yeah a very affordable price it will have to be steamed um to get it to their best ability but this is what it looks like it just sits just under your boobs it comes off the shoulder or you can put it just like this also i would prefer it off the shoulder um and then the back looks like this and you have this bow which you can place at the back or if you want to you can tie around a few times place it at the front or in um, on a side as well so it just depends on you but you do have a little bit of extra material which I do really like uh, because if it was up to here I wouldn't wear it I just feel like 
um, it will be way too short but with anything high waisted again I think this will look really really good it's not see-through at all it is double lined so it's made really really well and um, I would say it's from a material that is very breathable as well so if you do wear it you know you're not gonna get very sweaty in it so I'm really excited to try it on for you guys I think I definitely definitely will keep this I love it um, let me know what you guys think also. So I have the lilac top on and this is probably how I would wear it with just a pair of high-waisted jeans and not to have too much skin on show but with this down I don't feel like you have too much skin on show so I do actually really really like it. I love the way it sits off the shoulders also. I just feel like it complements it so so nicely and this lilac colour is everything. I will try and show you the back also. So I just done a bow. Now I was in two minds about this because it does look great on the website but I'm trying to picture me wearing it. Um, just because it is more of a editorial piece or I don't think you could wear stuff like this just out to the shop really. Um, so this is what it looks like. It's in a size 8 again and I want to tell you guys the price also. It was $74.50. Again, it's 50% off that I got on them. And I actually got an extra 10% off with um, Amy's code, which I'll put in the description bar if you'd like to use it. But this is what it looks like. So you have this see-through material, very puffed sleeved. However, you have an undergarment as well, so you know nothing is on display. And then it goes really, really flared out. And I'll try and show you it with the little slip underneath. So yeah, this is pretty much what it looks like. It was available in two colors as well. So you could get this mint color, or I think it might have been a pink. Oh yes, yeah, so it's a pink and a black also. Um, now you could get the black and just wear it very casually. However, I thought, I will try something like this and see how I feel about it. Um, hopefully it will look nice on me. But I just thought it was such an unusual colour. So it will really jazz up an outfit. Um, I will try and steam it before I wear it because it's super, super creased. So you guys can get a proper feel of what it looks like. I know I'm not doing it too much justice trying to show you on here. But it's actually super, super pretty. Um, and yeah, I can't wait to get it on. Okay, so dress is on and again surprisingly i actually really really like it love the puffiness of the sleeve and then the slip is super super comfortable so yeah i actually really like it i would probably wear it with some sock uh boots just like these these are from zara i just want to clarify i've just got my um email up so i will tell you the price it prices with a 60% off 10% extra will be linked for you down below if you like it so it's just a white t-shirt this is what it looks like it's got shoulder pads however the shoulder pads are actually really really nice if you have seen my Zara uh, video I did buy another t-shirt like this another color that had shoulder pads and they were ridiculous they just didn't sit very well but this as I'm holding it the structure of the shoulder pad is very very good and I think for 13 pounds you're getting a very good um, quality t-shirt it's not too see-through it's a tiny bit see-through uh, but not super see-through it is actually quite elasticated as well if you can see and that's pretty much what you're getting with it so this is a t-shirt on and I think that I'm just not liking the shoulder pads it's better than the ones that I got from Zara however no I don't think it's my style I do like the feel of it though so if you do like the shoulder pads and this is something for you then it is really nice of course this will have to be ironed so maybe if I just hold it a tiny bit you'll be able to see it just a little bit better but yeah in terms of the fit of it it's just a little bit baggy which is exactly what I would go for but I'm not a fan of these so this will be going back okay next up is another dress I believe now I like this when I saw it on her but again we'll see what it looks like on me let me get you the price and size for it it was in a size 8 and it was £49 and it's a white dress that looks like 
this and I absolutely love this kind of feathery accent to it. I feel like it will look so beautiful on. I love the fact that it drapes off the shoulders as well. So all of the little detail will just sit really nicely on your decollete. And yeah, I told you what size it was on. I will show you it just a tiny bit more. Um, again, as I'm seeing these clothes up close, I am actually very impressed with the quality of the items. With white dresses in particular, they can be very see-through. I can't see anything in this. However, I would still wear it with nude or white um, pants to it, just so I can be very, very safe. You can dress it up also, so you can wear this to a more formal event, I would say, because this is what the dress looks like. I will try and show it to you a little bit more. You do have a slit which is just a tiny bit, if you guys can see, just here. But the structure of the dress is actually quite formal, so you can dress it up or, you know, you could wear it pretty much um, anywhere. I would like a dress that has like a little bit more of an oomph, yet still looks a little bit structured in my wardrobe. Um, and I actually think the price is not too bad for it also. Okay, so I'm gonna have to hold this dress for you guys as well because it is, again, just way too tiny. However, I'm definitely um, getting a size up in this because I love it. This neckline is just everything. It's so, so nice. It is just a tiny bit see-through, uh, but I do love it. Of course, as you can see, it's just way too tight on me. I am holding it out of the back just so you can see what the neckline looks like just a tiny bit better i love the length of it the color i just feel like if i'm ever going on holiday as well this is such an amazing dress and it doesn't have too much puffiness at the top as well it's just the right amount however it's too tight on me it doesn't fit unfortunately but i will keep my eye for a size up so i think that's a size 10 so just bear in mind they do run really really small so if you are liking this just size up in it so exactly the same one in black also which looks like this shoulder pads this kind of like boxy look and i'm actually very pleased that i picked it up in black also because the quality is great okay so the black one is actually a little bit nicer than the white one because you can't uh, notice the shoulder pads as much and again i actually don't mind this one however i'm not gonna keep it because i know how i am with stuff i will chuck in my wardrobe and when it comes to wearing it i probably just would not wear it but if you do not mind the shoulder pads which now i know probably i'm just not a shoulder pad person on a t-shirt this is pretty much what it looks like okay next up is actually a pair of trousers which look great on her as all of these items do but i'll see how it looks on me so the trousers look like this again love the color of the trousers and i feel like this color is very in right now high-waisted and then you get this kind of structure all across it is all just one length doesn't um flare at all and it cuts just a little bit um on your by your ankle i think so um, hopefully I can get this on and it sits really nicely. This was in a small. It does have a belt also. Fortunately, guys, I could not get these on. They're a little bit too small, so I should have gone for a size up. But actually what I would do for you is just insert some pictures on the screen of what the actual trouser is supposed to look like if you do like it. I mean, the colour is beautiful and I do love the style of them. But unfortunately, they're just a little bit too um, small and way too tight around here also. So I got another dress. And this one actually reminds me of celebrity dresses. And especially the dresses that they used to do. And it looks like, <laughs> if I can hold it correctly, it looks like this. So more of an evening dress, a very bodycon dress. It is super nice though. I do really like it. It does stretch again quite a bit. It's got a zipper right at the back so you can easily get into it. And I do really love the pattern on it and this kind of goldy um, colour. I will show you it just 
so you can see the front a little bit better again i love the way it will sit off the shoulder and then you are getting this detail around the boobs and that's pretty much what it looks like so yes i would say you'll have to wear it on more of a special occasion um but again very well made i'm really impressed with them let's see how much i've actually paid for it it was 31 pounds which is mind-blowing for what you're getting right now this dress is definitely definitely worth 31 pounds i will try it on to see what it looks like on but even the material it feels a little bit heavy as it should not see through at all and it's elasticated so i know it will sit really really nicely on and i got this in a size eight also so this is the dress on i have to hold it with my hand at the back because it's just not fitting so i should have went for a size 10 but i still wanted to show you guys how beautiful it looks on so i do love the shoulder detail the way it just sits really nicely on the boobs i don't feel like it flattens the boobs which some um dresses that don't have any padding or anything like that and uh, can flatten the boob i love the waist area and excuse the fact that it does look too tight on me of course uh but you can see how it is super figure hugging and i can't move in it uh but yeah i think a size up a size 10 would have been perfect for me so just so you know it runs just a tiny bit small we're almost there two more items i will actually show you this item first now i'm very unsure about this if it will look nice on me again i would say it's more of a editorial piece but i did love it when i saw it on her so it's actually just a skirt which looks like this so it's in this kind of pink color you do have this elasticated waist so it sits really nicely um on and then it goes into all of this material so you have if i can go back you have a lot of material and um, i will try it on and just see how it looks again you'll probably have to wear this somewhere a little bit more special um but hmm i'll see i'll have to try it on it's just one of those pieces you rather hate or love when you try it on and um, i'll tell you how much this was i got in a size small and 25.55 so yeah again i mean the prices are great so the skirt is on and actually i really really love it this is what it looks like so it's very floaty kind of pinky i would actually mm, i would wear maybe a um biker shorts just underneath this just to be on a safe side i can't see anything through it at the moment but it's a tiny tiny bit see-through anyway this is what it looks like i've just paired it with a crop top and put this um quite high up and i love this kind of pinky color and the way it drapes also yeah i just think it's super super nice now on to the last item which is another top another white top which looks like this so dum -dum. i actually really really like this so it's off the shoulder it just sits on your um what is it on your shoulders <laughs> Um, and I love the kind of um, ruffle to it again it's made really really well I will show you on the inside as well just how well it is made so it has this kind of slip in um, inside it which kind of sticks to um, your skin just so it doesn't move again really impressed with them I don't shop too much on the website but whenever I do buy um trousers in particular i just know that i'm getting very very good quality with it as is all of this collection that i do have so let's see how much i've paid for it it was in a size 8 and it was 31 pounds very affordable you do have a zipper just at the back so you can easily get into it 
and the front of the top is a little bit cropped and this is what it looks like i would easily wear this with jeans also um or if i really want to dress it up a flare black trousers i feel like it will look really really good with this the white top is on and i do really love it it does have this kind of corset feel to it i feel almost if I'm wearing it with something like this, which I actually like. And the fact that it's really tiny, you can easily tuck it into trousers also. But this detail is just so flattering, I feel. And um, this is what the back looks like. So yeah, I'm super happy with it again. It's not see-through, great quality. The only thing I would say with it is, I don't have much room if I was to move my arms thank you for watching guys i really hope you enjoyed this video if you did let me know what was your favorite piece or if you did get any from her collection that i haven't shown i would really like to know what you've got everything will be linked in the description bar and if you like videos like this don't forget i do other videos like this so other haul videos and beauty videos here on my channel so check out any other ones and i will have a primark one coming up very very soon and if you haven't seen i've just done a new in zara which i will link in the description bar also but i hope to see you in my next video and i hope that you stick around for more videos like this bye guys